Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to show you the Christmas journal that I'm working on. I actually just made the cover. Um, I've been working on the inside pages last night and then I was trying to figure out what kind of cover I wanted because I don't have any um, Christmas fabrics besides the like the retro Santa um, snowman and Rudolph but they don't uh, that style doesn't work with this journal that I'm making so I was going through all my fabrics and I found a uh, I think it's a 12 by 12 or 8 by 8 I don't remember let's see Oh, it was 11 by, no, probably 12 by 12 um, piece of uh, Tim Holtz fabric that has just like music on it. And I like the color because it's just like very subtle. And so I made this cover and I also have some um, padding so it's soft to the touch. And then I just sewed this picture on and I put some lace on the back and put some nice paper on the inside and this is what I'm gonna sew in um, I don't know if you can see this I'm still figuring out how many pages I want um, and which ones so I'm trying to keep it all in the same like beige, white, off-white red blue some green i guess so i actually like this a lot this is from an old christmas um song book this one and i think i'm gonna use another page of that i found this one at a estate sale and i lo i actually love this cover i'm actually thinking about turning this into a christmas journal as well because it's it feels really nice and it's a really good shape and it's I think from the 50s I don't know but yeah it's old and I like it a lot so anyway yeah that's what I'm working on and I figured I'm gonna add another of those pages I actually uh, bent open those staples because I didn't want to tear the paper when I took the paper uh, the pages out because I want to use the whole thing in my oh nice Noel in my journal. As you can hear, I'm still I still have a stuffy nose. Um, we actually had to go get tested for COVID today because my husband and I both had sore throats, and so he stayed home yesterday. We kept our daughter out of daycare because they they wanted us to get tested because she's too young to get tested. And in order for my husband to go back to work and my daughter, our daughter, to go back to daycare, we needed negative tests. And, of course, we were tested negative. Um, it was just a cold. But you got to be careful. So, of course, we're going to get tested. Okay, so I think that was... How long was that? Okay by five let's see I'll make sure I have this Noel Noel and five I mean it's too bad that I have to cut off some of the um, words but you can still tell that it's Christmas music Okay, let's see. This one was here. Got some coffee dyed paper, uh, music paper. This is scrapbook paper, and I printed on the back um, from a cookbook. More scrapbook paper. This one is from an old, um, uh, what is it called? Work basket like in super old magazine and I saw that it had like Christmas stuff so that was like perfect 
And on the other side, it has old wanted ads. And somewhere I saw you can make a thousand dollars monthly. Uh, it's possible to make a thousand dollars monthly by raising earthworms. <laughs> now I guess that was the money maker back then. Okay, where do I want my music? I think I'm gonna stick it in here, and that will be the inside. Okay. So, oh, why is this taller? Hello. Oh, it's not. It just was, didn't line up. And I don't care that this sticks out. I mean, it's a junk journal, so it's going to be junky. And then I'm also going to make some uh, ephemera, like tags. I'm going to put in some pockets. I was thinking about putting a pocket back here. And then stick something in there. I actually, let's see if I can find what I was going to use. Where did it go? I really like this picture. Uh, like a sideways one. Oh, maybe this one. Postcard. Just stick it here, then you could put a few tags in there. I might do that. All right. So, what was I gonna do? Oh yeah, I have to figure out what color of thread I want to use. Um. See what we got. Do I want see that doesn't really work? No, need like a I wish I had like a green like that. Have a brown. Should I do like cream? What is the difference between these two? Probably nothing. Huh, doesn't say. <sighs> well, bubber. Maybe I'll find something at the store. Walmart sells those. I'll just take a piece of the paper with me. Like that, so I have the red and the uh, the green, and then I can see uh, if they have a color that works. If not, then I might just go with the. No, that's too boring. I think I want, yeah, either a red or a green. No, nope. okay. So I'll stick these all back in here. Yep. Let's see. Oh yeah, um, I found when I went through those little warp baskets. Let me get one for you. Through these guys, where I got the ads from. Uh, this one was a Christmas issue. And they had these um, cute little envelopes where you can uh, subscribe or order stuff. And it's like Christmas, oops, Christmas themed. I thought that was so cute. Back then you had to put a three cent um, stamp on the envelope. And then this one. That's from 1955. Oopsies. I thought that's really adorable. I like this one. So I'm gonna definitely use this. There's Santa. And not in this one, but in some other uh, journal was um, I just took it out now so I wouldn't forget about it all right let's get these guys back into the drawer I made this uh, cover I was working on the floor because I don't have enough room on my desk and all my fabric is in a bin on the bottom shelf of my storage unit so I would just cut and glue and sew on the floor all right, what was I gonna do? I put the paper in. So how many pages do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, 
Okay, so 22, 44 pages. Um, and then I need pockets and stuff. Uh, this way. I really love this collection. It's the, uh, let's see, vintage. Where is it? Where's the cover? Okay, I guess I lost the cover. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, I think this is the cover. Uh, Christmas vintage from Stamperia. The colors are just really nice. And I also have this one. It's also a little, little Christmassy, more on the nature side. That's nice. Okay, so we got the uh, pocket, and I also want to use part of this paper because I love this. And a Christmas tree and this piece. And I already made uh, this journaling card. I just have to distress it. And I think I'm going to stick that in here as well. I might just distress this right now before I forget. Okay. So this might be the only Christmas journal I'm going to do for now to sell on Etsy. Because... It's gonna get really close to Christmas by the time I would finish everything else, so and I also want to do other stuff. I'm just a little late to the game, I guess. Should have started a couple months ago. But yeah, I just got my motivation back and my inspiration. And sometimes it's just hard to figure out what you actually want to work on. Because there's so many so many ideas and so many things and I was um my husband and I were working on our Christmas wish lists because um, we always share our Amazon wish lists with um, his family and I, I have almost nothing on my list because I don't like I have all the craft stuff that I like all the things that I could I mean of course I want always want more but um, I, I gotta use what I have so I don't know what to Put on my list. Okay. Oh, my sponge is losing its sponginess. So this will go in a pocket. I gotta figure out how many pockets I'm gonna make. I don't want to cover up those nice pages. Whoever gets the journal, they can either write on it or cover it up. So we have one writing page. I might put something on there so they can actually write on it. So there could be a a pocket so one two three I don't know what to do about this one three yeah, four five okay I'm gonna need a whole bunch of pockets and corners and maybe a little belly band too all right so that's what I am going to work on <coughs> and once I make, <coughs> excuse me, once I make some more progress, I will show you if you're interested and then I can just like film every time I work on it or have made more progress because I noticed that my longer videos don't get as many views, probably because it's boring for people that, like, if you just craft and talk and people don't know you, it might be boring, but if you watch a crafter that's popular and people know them already, then obviously they're more interested in what, they, what they're talking about. Okay, so probably going to put this here. Let's see if any of my Christmas tags that I made work. I don't think they work with this. Let's see. No, it's just a different style. 
Maybe. No. Not sure. Yeah, I don't I don't think those work. Although this is from the same same collection. So I guess I'll just sell them like this. Maybe someone's interested. Same with these guys. The stylus just too different and not the same. Okay. I'll make new ones. Okay. So that's all I got for today. And I'll see you in my next video. Thanks so much for watching.